welcome to uh, wash out laundry services here in beautiful sunny Delta, British Columbia. I've got um, Mike Friedis here with me, the owner of, um, of wash out and he's going to say a couple words before um, I get started and uh, I'm Lynn Mueller, President and CEO of Shark Energy. So I'm going to pass it over to Mike now. Thank you, Lynn. Uh, hello, everyone. Thanks for joining us today. Yeah, my name is Mike Friedis. I'm the founder of Wash Out Laundry here in uh, beautiful Delta, BC. We're really excited uh, about today to unravel the Piranha system. And uh, I just wanted to uh, thank Lynn for his hard work and his team for their amazing job that they've done uh, with the install. And I just can't tell you how excited we are to see this in action and, and uh, you know, get, get, to, get to some real savings. Um, also, special thanks to Fortis for their effort in making this happen. Uh, I just the, the whole process end to end has just been phenomenal. And this is going to be so transformative for our business and uh, our customers alike. You know, what we do here at Washout uh, is laundry for residential and commercial services uh, with focus in healthcare, uh, senior homes, hotels, and as well as residential laundry. We kind of posture ourselves as the skip the dishes of laundry for those of you that aren't familiar with, with the service that we do. It's an app-based laundry service where customers can order online at washout.ca or through our app. And uh, we obviously use a tremendous amount of water by the nature of the work that we do. And we were fortunate enough to, to meet up with the good folks at Shark and learn about the Piranha system and have it implemented here in our, uh, in our wash plant uh, today. So without further ado, I'll pass it back to, to Lynn. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Mike. So uh, let me just tell you a little bit about the Shark and the Piranha system we've installed here at Washout. You can see behind us is the entire system. The blue tank over here catches the wastewater as it's leaving the building. And we just efficiently scrubbed the heat back out of it. So we've been able to work with Fortis to lower the natural gas use here by about 50% and replace it with green, uh, green electric uh, efficient equipment. So the Piranha, as we were watching it this morning, working operates at about 400% efficient. So for every dollar we spend to operate the Piranha, we recover $4 worth of hot water for Mike. So by, by being a BC company, we've created about 15 jobs at Shark. Mike has about the same number of people here at Washout. And we hired a company out of uh, Richmond called Ashton Services to do the installation. And so a very nice made in BC, green energy, climate solution right here at home. So we're very lucky to have uh, Kelly make time to join us today. Kelly Green is the MLA for my hometown there in Richmond. And we're very honored to have you join us today, Kelly. Maybe say a few words for us. Thanks so much, Lynn and Mike, for having me here today and for being leaders in sustainable business practices. Uh, it's great to be here from the territory of the Coast Salish people from my home in Richmond and to mark this occasion with local leaders and clean tech innovators from Shark and Washout Laundry, as well as former Premier Mike Harcourt. Uh, Mike is a longtime champion of sustainability and continues to advance climate action through his directorship on the board of Shark, among other efforts. And I'd like to talk about this new project. This new energy recovery project is a really inspiring example of clean economy right here in action here in Metro Vancouver. Uh, and thanks to the commitment of Washout and Shark and through Fortis BC's financial support, this new waste heat recovery system is going to significantly reduce carbon pollution and conserve freshwater resources. Um, it's an innovative technology that will repurpose thermal energy that's usually flushed down the drain and use it again, making this project process much more energy efficient and an important stride towards a truly circular economy, which is where we need to be in the future. This new system builds on the substantial actions already taken by both of these companies and is a really great example of small and medium businesses here in BC taking the lead on climate. I'm just so impressed and uh, honored to be here today. Um, our government's been supporting small and medium businesses through a range of incentives for energy efficiency through Clean BC. 
And much of the support comes through a Better Buildings program, which includes partnerships with Fortis BC. We've also recently supported a similar waste uh, heat recovery project through Clean BC Communities Fund in partnership with the federal government and municipalities. So for example, we're helping to expand the waste heat recovery system at the False Creek Neighborhood Energy Utility in Vancouver. And the expanded system will recycle more heat from wastewater to reuse it for local residents and businesses in the Olympic Village area and surrounding neighborhoods. Shark Energy has also been involved with the False Creek Utility, installing their wastewater filtration technology for the neighborhood. We've also partnered with the City of Richmond through the Clean BC Communities Fund to support a new waste heat recovery system for the Olympic, or sorry, Oval Village <laughs> development. Uh, this new system will replace the natural gas boilers as the main source of heating and hot water for residents and businesses and when complete around 80% of the area's energy demand will be met by this system. Waste heat uh, recovery is going to be such an important part of the future uh, and we're at the leading edge of it right here. And support for the City of Richmond and Vancouver's waste heat recovery projects will reduce emissions by about 30, 375,000 tonnes of carbon over 30 years. It's about taking 135,000 cars off the road for a year. These are remarkable savings and I think it's safe to say that this kind of innovation is so important for us in BC and elsewhere in British Columbia. This kind of innovation is going to see economic, environmental and social success. And these solutions are going to encourage adoption in other regions. And I know that Shark has had interest south of the border to expand their business in the United States and elsewhere. I just want to say that, you know, I'd like to encourage this kind of innovation to continue to grow our clean economy and support good jobs for people in BC communities across the province. And thank you again for having me and congratulations to both companies. And I'll pass the floor to Delta City Councillor and Acting Mayor Dylan Kruger. Thank you. Thank you so much for joining us, Kelly. We really do appreciate it. Um, we're going to be bothering you again here soon to tell you about our Shark Bite program, the Canadian made climate solution that we're going to be launching soon. So thank you so much again. And I want to introduce a young man here, Dylan Kruger, is the acting mayor of Delta. And uh, we're thrilled that uh, Delta is stepping up for sustainability. Uh, can you uh, say a couple of words, please, Don? Well, thanks so much, Lynn and, and uh, Kelly for your introduction. It's, it's really exciting to be with you here virtually today um, on behalf of Mayor Harvey and all of Delta Council. Uh, and just uh, a huge congratulations both to, to Washout and to Shark for this amazing partnership here in our community. Uh, I sit as a member of Metro Vancouver's Climate Action Committee, and I'm also chair of our Climate Action and Livability Committee here in Delta. And I think I recognize, we all recognize uh, the issues of energy efficiency and greenhouse gas emission reduction are critically important. We require leaders such as uh, your two companies, uh, as well as all levels of government to address the urgent issue of climate change. Washout Laundry Systems is an outstanding example of a local Delta-based business that is leading and making important advances towards reducing its own energy use and lowering carbon dioxide emissions. In response to a, a pretty comprehensive uh, climate change motion that Mayor George Harvey put forward uh, this fall, Delta Council has recently adopted new ambitious community-wide greenhouse gas emission targets to reduce um, our uh, community-wide greenhouse gas emissions by 45% below 2007 levels by 2030 and to become uh, net zero in our emissions by 2050. We will need all sectors of our community to make significant reductions in greenhouse gas emissions to meet those targets and installations like the one that we're here discussing today provide a great example of what's possible with the innovative technology uh, that's being discussed and engaged business and support from the utilities as I'd like to acknowledge the funding provided by Fortis BC for this project. So just in closing, a, a huge thank you to Washout Laundry for your contribution towards our community's goals and our collective greenhouse gas reduction goals in the region. And I so look forward to working uh, with, with yourselves, other Delta-based businesses, uh, as well as Shark on, on potential uh, future opportunities to be more efficient, reduce emissions uh, and, sa and save money here in our community. So a big thank you and thank you for having me here today. Thank you so much, Dylan. Um, I think we're gonna, we're gonna jump over Mr. Harcourt for now and we're gonna introduce 
Jason Wolf, Director of Energy Solutions from Fortis. And uh, Jason, first of all, Mike and I'd like to thank you for your participation in this project. And we were, uh, we were so excited to become a, a part of the Fortis commercial program. And we really worked hard to get this project delivered on time. And we ended up a couple of days early here. We're running now. So thank you, Jason. And can I get you to say a few words about uh, Fortis's program for us? Uh, absolutely, absolutely. Great to be here. Would love to be there in person, of course. And maybe uh, once COVID is over, we can actually do that. A lot of the thanks that isn't really, shouldn't be directed actually at me. It should be for Chris Alionis from Fortis DC, our key account manager. He's been really instrumental in working with our customers to get these programs off the ground. Um, you know, for Fortis BC though, reducing emissions and helping our customers be more efficient with their energy is really important to us. And, and you can probably see in my background here, we have a 30 by 30 target uh, at Fortis BC to reduce our customers' greenhouse gas emissions by 30% by 2030. And in order to do that, we really do need collaboration with companies like Washout and with Shark Technology to help us get there. Commercial buildings and businesses, though, are often very different, and it's very hard to do a kind of a, a blanket program for these types of uh, businesses. So what we've done is we've put together a, a performance program that helps businesses develop custom solutions like the one we're talking about today to help these customers be more efficient, reduce emissions, cost, and improve the facility's performance. Over the last 10 years, we've supported hundreds of customers uh, in the commercial program in public and private sectors, and we hope to work with Shark Technology on many more installations to come. Of course, I'd like to thank Lynn and, and Shark Technology and Washout, and of course, as I mentioned, Chris Alionis for his hard work and working with all our customers to bring these solutions to fruition. We're thrilled to work with you on this, and we look forward to the day it's completed. Thanks very much. Uh, thank you so much, Jason, and um, we're looking forward to a long and uh, and happy relationship with Fortis. We've got some projects lined up all over the province. And uh, another thing I just wanted to mention to Kelly is that there's 2,000 tons of CO2 emissions offset by this one one job. So when um, uh, when Mike's introducing us to all of his laundry buddies now, we are just so excited. I've got three beautiful little grandchildren that I'm busy trying to find a way to protect this world. So this is this is a huge day for us. But I want to introduce uh, Mr. the Honorable Mr. Mike Harcourt, who I got to know a long uh, number of years ago uh, with the Quest organization, Quality Urban Energy Systems of Tomorrow. And everybody knows Mike as Mike, but most people don't know that he's championed energy systems for cities around the world and he's been a mentor and a friend and just an amazing man so mike could you say a couple of words for us thanks lynn well i'm i'm delighted to uh, be part of, of your team and and uh and as the founder of shark and and the inventor and the entrepreneur that's driven shark to the huge success that it's accelerating towards, I congratulate you on behalf of the board of, of Shark. And and I'm uh, delighted, uh, Mike, that you and Washout are, are, are part of the growing solutions uh, and the kind of entrepreneurs that we're proud of in British Columbia uh, to have you not only try and do well, but do good too, to be able to uh, cut down on the greenhouse gas emissions and and the use of uh, energy and to work with Fortis who I have a lot of time for and have worked with on other projects like Aboriginal education and uh, many other ideas too. So I'm I'm delighted Lynn to uh, to be associated with this terrific idea that you came up with uh, a few years ago watching warm water hot water go down your your sink your kitchen sink and and to have been to come up with shark that's on the verge of uh, tremendous expansion uh centered right here in in british columbia uh, is very exciting so i'm i'm here to say thank you uh, to all of you for making this happen thank you 
Thank you, Mr. Harcourt. Uh, thank you, folks. At this time, we're going to ask uh, Mike to go over to the unit, turn the bottom switch on, and we're starting to save carbon today. Uh, the equivalent of um, 200 cars, or no, pardon me, it's equivalent to 100 cars off the road for 20 years. So we're very excited about the results, looking forward to doing more. Kelly um, Shark does business all over the world and we're super proud to be a BC company and uh, we're gonna continue. And um, I love, um, I moved to Vancouver 35 years ago and into Richmond and it is the best place in the world to live. I'm so proud of Richmond and Vancouver in general. Let's keep it green and thanks for your help folks. Really appreciate you joining us today. The unit is now on. Ready? Here we go. And uh, we were testing it early, so it's already got the water heated up and turned off, but uh, we're officially operating. Thank you so much. Uh, we've got some, um, shark, shark stands for so much more than just energy. We're an inclusive company, we empower women. We think all our employees should be fulfilled for life. And we're looking forward to building a sustainable company for the future. Thank you very much, folks. Bye for now. Thanks, guys. Thanks, everyone. Great to be a part of it. We have recorded this if anybody wants it as well. So just let uh, Danny know at the office. Thanks so much. Thanks, Mike.